Hello, everybody. Okay, so today is Saturday. Uh, what is the date today? October um, 12th. So I did not film my um, video for what I purchased last Sunday um, for $4 day because I kind of wanted to combine it and plus I was lazy. <laughs> and now I can't find two of the items that I had purchased. I only got four items. So let me go ahead and get right into it. So the first item that I had bought, this is a, I've already opened it and I've already used it. It's pretty big, this box. Um, this right here, it's a monitor stand. Actually, you get two and they're really, really great. I got it because I needed it at work um, because I have two monitors and I do have monitor stands here at home and I'm currently using only one. So I brought one of them to work and then, um, when I got this, I brought the, you know, I brought, I brought it to use and it worked, it's working great. So, um, this is what it looks like. It's this dark, um, this black wood looking, uh, monitor. And the great thing about these is that it's a little bit longer than a usual monitor stand and it's lower. And, um, I love it. I wish I had actually <laughs> found another one. Maybe if I do, uh, hopefully it'll be in a different color. Um, but I got this set for $4 and it goes for $30 on Amazon. So this was such a steal. It's very, very sturdy. So I'll post a link, um, down below on Amazon. If you want to, um, if you want to pick one up. So I got that. And then the second item that I had got now, I had already purchased something like this before, um, a couple weeks ago for my niece, but I think I will give this to my other niece so that she has it for the summer next year. Cause you know, we live here in the South and, um, in the deep South and it gets really, really humid in the summertime. So this is another portable neck fan. I mean, I've given them also like little you know, hand fan type of things. I don't like this here. I've given them like one, like this, they can keep like in their purse and stuff. But, um, one niece is in band. And so she has to go to band camp in the summer and they have to practice outside. And then the other one is, um, she does soccer and I don't know if she's going to be doing any activities in the summer, but anyways, I'll still go ahead and, and give her um, this. And I love the fact that it's in a mint green and it works really well. It's exactly, I believe it's almost the same as the one that I got for her sister. So this is the one that I had previously purchased. So it's a little bit, just a little bit different, but you know, the concept, it still works out great. This one just has this, um, this thing right here, which I think, I'm not sure if air blows out of that as well, but, um, yeah, so it came with the, um, the charger, the charger, but I don't know what that thing is. That's kind of weird. But anyways, um, yeah, I mean, I got this for four bucks. Um, like I said, I purchased two other items and I honestly cannot even remember what they were and I don't know where they are. I think I put them away. And usually what I do is I leave the stuff here on my filming desk. So that way, you know, I can go ahead and film and stuff, but I had cleared it out because I'd filmed some other stuff this week and I have no idea where I put them. So if I do find them, I'll just throw them into the video for next week. Um, I'm going to just try to just film one video. It'll just be easier on me rather than having to pull up all of these separate clips to film. Okay. So I went to bin store number one this was from bin store number two went to bin store number one today six dollar day and it seems like they had a lot of good stuff but um i didn't really pick up a lot i only got five things so here's the first thing that i got so this is another oops sorry desk lamp it's um daylight and it has a charging a wireless charging base here um it comes with the actual charger which is great because most of most of the time you don't you know, you don't get the charger, you just get the, the cord, but it's black. And, um, I'm going to put this at my 
computer desk because I need more light. As you get older, you will find that you will need <laughs> one to wear readers. Two, you're, you know, you're going to need bright light in order to actually see small print. So, um, yeah, I just need the additional light um, at my desk. So we got that. And then let me pull this back. There we go. I changed the angle a little bit on this camera. So if it looks a little weird, just let me know. So the next item I found, which was interesting, which was the large nylon crescent crossbody bag. So these are becoming really popular, this style. Um, I think mostly because Uniqlo was the one that kind of popularized it, especially in Asia. Um, we don't have a Uniqlo here in Memphis, but we are getting a Primark. <laughs> but anyways, um, I saw this and so I immediately grabbed the box and then had them open it. So I don't know if this is bigger than the ones that they sell at Uniqlo, but you know, it's still a, not a bad, um, not a bad size. And I might just use this as like my everyday bag for work because I can fit a lot of stuff in here. Not that I carry a lot of stuff. It's just that I want to be able to have the room to have my glasses, my readers, my sunglasses, my small wallet, you know, my phone, and um, just this other small stuff that I carry. Uh, and I could use it also for travel because then I can fit this camera that I'm using, which is a Canon M50 in here. So um, yeah, I just hope that the strap is going to be um, stitched. It's strong enough. If I don't carry a lot of stuff, then it should be fine. I mean, eventually, maybe I'll just, you know, break down and then just go ahead and get, um, order a bag from Uniqlo, but we'll see because I don't want it to be too small. <laughs> All right. So the next items that I got, uh, let's get rid of this big one here first because it's taken up so much space. Okay. So it's this baking pan. Actually, let me take it out of the bag so you can actually see it. It's $6 and I don't know how much it goes for on Amazon. I'll have to look. But when I saw this, I was thinking about, you know, holidays are coming up and um, Thanksgiving and Christmas. And I tend to always, well, my contribution to the family um, dinner would be like this corn casserole that I make, but I might change it up and do something else. So I figure, because we, I don't think we have a pan like this, like at least this deep. And I think we need a new one anyways. And I love that it's a ceramic nonstick. So um, that's the reason why I picked it up. And I like the color. <laughs> so um, yeah. I'm pretty sure that my mom will be happy when she sees this. So not bad for six bucks. I don't have to buy it over at um, TJ Maxx and Marshall, Marshall's now. Okay. So let's see here. I think I have oh, two more items. Okay. This one just fell out of the box because the box is open. So we got this here. Um, I have yet to actually buy anything that's from Beauty of jo um, Josen. And so I saw th that they had the, um, the ginseng uh, cleansing oil. And so I thought, okay, I might as well try it. I'm really into the cleansing oils now, now that I understand how to use it. So um, basically you just use it on your face, on your dry face. You don't wet your face. So, you know, one pump and you're on your hands and then just all over your face. And then after that, wash it. And then I do the um, foaming cleanser. And that has worked out so good for my um, oily skin. I just wish I'd known that that's what I should have been doing all this time. So got that, six bucks. And then the last item I got here is this Elta oil and uh, gel cleanser. So, I have this um, moisturizer sunscreen in this brand, and um, it has a lot of good reviews, both in the Facebook, like the K-Beauty group, and then I believe also probably on Reddit. So um, this one has pumpkin enzyme, meadow foam, meadow foam, seed oil, and vitamin E. It's 
good for all skin types, including sensitive and acne prone. So let me smell this. Oh, good. There's actually no scent at all. It's scent unscented. So I'll give this a try. Um, I'm always, you know, down to try new stuff. So I thought this will be, um, you know, it's for six bucks. I know that the moisturizer sunscreen that I got from uh, the same bin store when I got it for, I believe I got it for probably a dollar. And I really wish I had bought more, but I didn't know that it was really that good. And they had tons of it at the time. And I only picked up one because I wasn't sure. That sunscreen goes for like $34 on Amazon. And yeah, when I purchased mine at $1, it was brand new. Um, so yeah, we'll see. Maybe I'll use this cleanser and then use the sunscreen moisturizer. So, so yeah. So these are all the items that I got from the bin stores. Um, tomorrow is $4 a day. So I will go and I will try to remember what I bought so that I can show you guys. So that's it. I hope everyone's having a great week and a great day. Bye.